Hi everyone, you know I was in the mood when I tried this dress on first for, from Timu and I put one of my Amazon hats on here. I just knew, I knew I had to have a summer wine, a wine diary this summer. Dressed like this, it's the perfect little summer outfit I thought, but what was I going to have? I had no idea, but you know what? I think it's hurricane season. Yeah, it's hurricane season. It's a hurricane category five. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. To my subscribers, thank you guys so much. It means so much to me that you're able to take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means so much to me. I appreciate you guys more than you know. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you would consider hitting that little red subscribe button before you go. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. Today is Friday, so you know, I, it, it's like, it just feels like it's a long week, but at the same time, it is flying by so fast. We are like coming to the end of summer. We're like middle of August. I know we're going to have some nice warm days left, but pretty soon, I mean, we're already in the fifties at night. We're still like eighties, nineties during the day, but like fifties and sixties at night, at night, it just feels like a nice crisp fall air, but, and I know fall is coming. It's like you don't want summer to end. I love the fall, but you know, after fall comes that four letter word that starts with an S and ends with a W. I'm not looking forward to that. So anyway, the weeks are flying by. We're almost like mid-August, getting towards late August. But you know what? When I got this dress from Timo and I did a try on with it, of course I have on my Shea necklace right here, my Timu earrings, and I put on this Amazon hat right here in this pretty shade of blue. I knew I just had to wear this for a summer wine diary. So anyway, I, what I wanted was, you know, and I had that volare a couple of weeks ago from my Saracini, and I was hoping that maybe at a slight chance I bought a third bottle of their blue champagne. I did not, and I was thinking of ordering one but then to get free shipping from Italy, it was $75, you know, and I said, well, I really, I have so much wine. I don't want to buy $75 more worth just to get free shipping. So I said, you know what, I'm going to go online to like the local liquor stores that deliver to me. And all of them that had like a blue champagne or blue sparkling wine, they were all like $30 to $50. And it's like, I don't want to spend that much. It's, it's just for me. So anyway, I thought, well, you know, I'm having a good day. I'm going to go to the liquor store, the closest one to me, and see what they have. So I thought maybe maybe they have like a blue margarita or something like that, but they didn't. What they had was, and it's heavy, it is Hurricane, and that's Palm, which I never heard of, Hurricane, Category 5, it's a hurricane drink, and it's blue. So I thought, okay, you know, that'll do. And actually, this is a Minnesota company, it's Princeton, Minnesota, so... 10, 15, 15 minutes away from me. So I thought, you know what? We're going to go for this. The champagnes were like $30 at that store that were the blue champagnes, the sparkling wines. This was, this big longer thing was $5.98. And I said, you know what? $5.98 wins. So I put some ice in my champagne flute and then put it in the freezer to get it nice and cold. So my glass is cold. I'm not sure if you're supposed to Put this with ice and blend it but you know it's friday night if i don't like it like this if it's too strong i can always go and blend it later so i got my blue hurricane here category five oh, you know i remember hurricane season living in new england watching it come up the coast and 
but you know we never got it as well you know I think in the 30s they did they had a bad hurricane I mean we had some that blew out windows and some local flooding things like that but nothing devastating like they get in Florida and Louisiana you know Katrina and yeah so they get it a lot worse than us than we did but anyway it looks so pretty it goes with my dress I'm excited to try this and of course I've got snacks I've got snacks. That's the best part of Wine Diaries, you know. So cheers, everybody. Happy Friday. Hope everyone has some plans for a great weekend. It's getting to be the end of summer. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Cheers, everyone. It's good. It's coconutty. It's pineapple-y. It's rum. It's nice and cold. I can live with that. So good. Of course, it would be good blended too to make it a little weaker. But my snacks. So I haven't had some of my Eastern Provisions pretzels in a while. So I heated up some of these little bites in my air fryer and then I drizzled them with some butter and I've got some mustard dip to put on it. And then I did a couple of those meatballs again. So this time I used that maple, the Four Brothers, the maple, maple bourbon sauce the barbecue sauce mix it with a little grape jelly i got some extra right here so let me try one of these bad boys first cheers everyone mm. that is really good nice little snack nice little drink and it's blue all righty so I'm going to take one of my pretzels, dip it in my honey mustard dip. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is good. Nice, tangy, salty, sweet. Cheers. Mmm. So good. I'm just going to finish swallowing and we'll be back because that's rude. Alrighty, so I finished my pretzel. So, so good. Lightly buttered, done in the air fryer, so no extra butter other than what I put on it. The pretzel salt. I love the pretzel salt. Not too much because too much salt doesn't taste so good, but just the right amount. Perfect. Dipped in the honey mustard. I've got some of that maple bourbon with the, the barbecue sauce from Four Brothers mixed with the grape jam. It's nice and thick. I'm going to try some of the pretzels dipped in there and some of the meatballs dipped in the mustard. Hey, you got uh, meatballs in my mustard. Hey, you've got mustard in my meatballs. Kind of remember that like Reese's? Yeah. So anyway, I'm going to try those. Have a little fun with it. I actually did another Target uh, home shopping that is so so convenient when you you don't have the strength to go walk into the grocery store and uh i got some ice cream i haven't got ice cream in a long time so i've got the i forgot which brand it was but it was the dulce de leche so so good i'm gonna have a little bit of that for dessert as well and just gonna sit outside on the deck for a while i might have a little fire tonight while it's cooling down in the nights i'm gonna use some of my duraflame my just one so that I don't have to sit up there all night I'm gonna sit and relax with that for a while finish my drink finish my dinner here and then I'm gonna go and work on YouTube for a bit so I want to thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to s sit and talk with me I have still got now I've got like eight new bottles from wink wine I've got uh, June and July that I haven't even opened yet. I think probably because I've been enjoying some of the summer drinks, which is which is fine. So anyway, we've got a few weeks left of summer. I would love love to hear your suggestions on maybe a frozen uh, flavored margarita you would like me to try or a rum drink something like that or something that you've maybe seen in these big monger bottles that are you know ready to serve you don't have to have all these kinds of liquors that I used to have in the house but I don't anymore because you know we don't really have people over but yeah to make maybe some fun drinks like that or a fun summer wine to try I probably have enough of my own without having to buy anything else but sometimes you just want to get something new you know what I mean or something to go with an outfit like this blue outfit so maybe if you've seen me in a colorful outlet 
at an outlet, an outfit from like Timu, and you say, you know, that reminds me of that uh, green Midori drink we had a while ago. Yeah, let me know, and I would love to do a wine diary in your name. So anyway, thank you guys so much. I hope you guys have a fabulous, fabulous weekend, a great Friday night. I hope everyone takes care. Be safe, be kind, be happy, enjoy life, have some fun. Love you guys so much, and we will see you in the next video. Love you guys. Bye-bye.